Good morning guys, today is Friday, March 3rd, and this is going to be the beginning to my Munchy Monday series. So if you're new to my channel, basically every single Monday I'll be uploading a full day of eating, and this is going to be episode 1 today, so welcome. Um, I'm actually going to do a grocery haul in today's video as well, because I don't know if you guys can see that right there, Omar and I got some groceries from Milk and Eggs. I've talked about them before, um, I have actually like a full video about them, so I'll link that down below so you guys can get like a better idea as to what they are and stuff, but long story short, they do deliver groceries from local farms uh, here in the LA County. I think it's only in the LA County for now, but I think they're expanding stuff, which is awesome. The groceries are actually really cheap compared to stores like Whole Foods, and we even shop at Aldi, and I'd say they're very, very comparable for prices-wise, and they even deliver it straight to your door. So just to give you guys an idea, they come in these little bags, and this is like the stuff that doesn't need to be frozen, and then this is the bag for the things that do need to be kept cold. Um, and it's really cool and then you can even uh, recycle these so you don't have to throw them out or anything So to start off we have two pineapples and I actually don't really know how we're gonna cut them exactly I've never done that before, but we're gonna attempt it. We'll see and then we have one watermelon three mangoes These are like my all-time favorite fruits. I would say pineapple and mango and then watermelons like number three And then we also have two cartons of strawberries two cartons of blueberries carrots some of this nitro cold brew coffee Omar and I saw it on the website and we just really wanted to try it out, so we got two. I'll probably have it for a pre-workout today. And then he also wanted to try this, like, dark coffee. I don't know. For me, this sounds too much because I like, you know, lighter coffee. We have one green pepper, some mini blueberry bagels. I'm very excited for these. Um, also, some sprouted California-style bread. This apparently has protein, or it said protein bread on the website. I don't know the actual macros on it, but we'll see. Um, then we have some sun-dried tomatoes some feta cheese sun-dried tomatoes. I'm very excited for that, it sounds so good. Um, provolone cheese for Omar, and then we have four cartons of eggs, and some Khalifa Farms vanilla almond milk. That's about it for a grocery haul for the week. Um, we actually also got some water because, like water jugs, because we have not had water in our apartment. Um, we've just been buying gallons, which really sucks, and we know that. Um, so we finally ordered some from them. This is alkaline water, and it apparently levels out your pH level in your body, which is cool. We actually don't have the machine for it. We've just kind of been pouring it into the gallons that we have and working with that. But we will be ordering the machine soon. Um, because this just makes a lot more sense than having to buy the gallon every single time. So with that being said, if you guys live in the LA County or the LA area and you want to support your local farms, definitely check out um, that company. They're awesome. And they have great people working behind them. So I'll have the link in the description bar to their website and to the video where I actually explained exactly like in detail what they are and what they do and stuff. So we're going to make some food. I'm starving and then we're going to head on over to the gym. It's really nice outside right now. It's like 80s and sunny. And here's breakfast for today. So I have a sandwich with turkey and eggs. And then I have oatmeal with Khalifa Farms almond milk and Woman's Best cookies and cream plant-based protein. It's amazing. And then I topped it off with honey. And then I'm also having a full mango that Omar so nicely cut up for me. So this will be my breakfast as well as pre-workout meal. You guys, so I totally lied. My breakfast was not my pre-workout meal. This is, so I'm having a carton of blueberries, an English muffin with woman's best protein cream on top, and then some coffee with almond milk. So it is currently 8.30 p.m. I apologize for the really bad lighting. It's dark outside and we have horrible lighting in the apartment. But I had one of the most intense leg workouts that I've had in like a really long time. I almost felt like throwing up at the end. I just feel like I needed maybe a little bit more food in me before that intense leg workout. But it's cool. I just made some dinner and 
I'm very excited to show you guys. So to start off, I have a black bean veggie burger. These are the ones that I use. I get these from Whole Foods and they're amazing. Let me see the macros because I don't remember the top of my head. 4.5 fat, 19 carb, 4 fiber, and 6 protein. And then I also made myself um, this whole bag of ready to serve brown rice. There's about two servings in here. And I topped it off with this feta cheese sun-dried tomato mix, which by the way, I had a little bit of it before I put it on and it's so good. Um, and then on the side, I also have some mini carrots just for some veggies. And then for dessert, I'll be finishing off with a Lenny and Larry's cookie, the whole thing. So that's about it for this video. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Munchy Mondays, episode one. I'm very excited for this series because I feel like It'll make me want to try some different foods and hopefully I can give you guys ideas of like, you know, some healthy meals, maybe some not so healthy meals, but this is how I eat on a daily basis. So um, I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Thumbs up if you did and I will see you all in the next one.